Hi my beautiful Aquarius, how are you doing today? This is your reading for the month of September 2018. Also if you like please like subscribe or share my videos. Also if you want some something specific for you which resonates just for you don't hesitate to give me a, a email and let me know what you're looking for usually I do just love relationships and couples even singles but everything related to love also Keep in mind, it's a general reading. If not resonates with you in the first three till five minutes, this reading is not for you. Keep in mind, it's a general reading. These messages I am giving is just for, for a specific few and could not resonate for a lot of people. Also, somebody in the comments told me they're skeptical about already put the cards on the table. Yes, I put them on the table, not because I don't want to show you guys how I'm shuffling the cards, but just because I don't want to lose time just shuffling and you see me shuffling, shuffling and then put it on a table, okay? So that will get rid of that unnecessary minutes in our videos, so that could proceed to reading more quickly, okay? So let's begin Aquarius for 2018 for September. So my spirit guides told me to get all these cards. I didn't even ask like seven cards. Oh, okay. All right. So at this point in your life, what start with four of uh, swords, knight of pentacles, eight of pentacles, two of wands, justice the Fool and Ace of Wands. So at this point in your life you want a new beginning, a fresh new start, very fresh and you are just, I'm done with the past, even I start still reflecting, either I'm still working on myself but you want to give to somebody something, something more stable or somebody want to give you something stable, a new fresh start it's a knight, it's not a king, it's something smaller than a king, but it's something. And now you choose your direction. You know what you want, even you feel haunted by the energy from the past. But being, being justified those actions, being the truth revealed probably here, or probably you were dealing with somebody who you were married, could be a fellow sign like you, a Gemini, Libra or Aquarius, or any sign because we have here fire energy, we have here swords, we have here pentacles. So it could be any sign at this point, but let's see the reading, what we reveal. And also I pulled some clarifying uh, cards, not for everybody. Oh, let's see. This is at the bottom of the deck, I never rem remove it. So you might deal with the nurse sign, but let's see because the devil I didn't clarify the devil so I wanna clarify the devil really quick for you guys so it will give us some insights okay so it's the death okay so at the bottom of the deck again we have the Sun and we have the high priestess but we'll talk about this a little later okay so current energies we have the devil could be a Capricorn we have nine of cups we have to death, we have page of swords and we have your card, queen of swords, which in the past what I'm seeing here something ended and the ending really badly with a lot of arguments, with a lot of like pity fights, even you might be indulgent after all this crap in your life, sorry for expression, but even the devil it's clarify about death. So something for sure ended in your past and you ended just because it was not a fulfilling relationship, was not something healthy, you feel very bound to this person you are, were dealing, you're feeling like very like not healthy, you didn't want it. Even it's showing nine of cups, which is a wish card, but here I'm seeing here between death 
and the devil I feel somebody was doing either drugs either too much eating or eating unhealthy or alcohol anything indulgently because I always said everything what is in excess it's an indulgence like some people indulge in too much work because they do make money or some people indulge in just party 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 it's too much okay and you speak your truth I don't want this I don't want to deal with the person like this instead I have a lot of passion towards you I still have a lot of feelings because nine of cups that show me feelings but this queen is talking the truth and when she appear here because I'm seeing here it's you and she just doesn't want to take BS but somebody hold on in this could be an earth sign but something was holding you back probably you knew this person is not a healthy person this person needs to work on themselves and the relationship basically ended because somebody didn't want to make the effort okay that's what I'm seeing and seeing the the death clarifying the the devil that shows me this relationship you've been which could be with uh, Scorpio could be a Capricorn could be any other sign could be it's for sure not for sure like strongly Scorpio person in here okay in this present what we have here it's the world we have two of cups we have Queen of Cups we have Ten of Swords and also we have Six of Swords so this Queen of Cups is this person this is Cancerian energy but anyway it's a water sign as Scorpio Cancer Pisces they are energy but even this person feels it's your soulmate something is the ending at this point or did the end already because the world here show us it's an ending here okay and some uh, somebody's moving on which I'm seeing you are moving on from this water sign you were dealing even you or them feel it's a soulmate and you feel a lot of love towards them you feel it's unhealthy why what I'm seeing here could be a third party because ten of swords it's clarified by three of pentacles even you or them wanted to work but three shows me it's a crowd it's three people involved or other people or some people telling me hey this person is not good for you because they do these kind of things so keep in mind that something is not clear here and this is your energy at this point and you move moving on because source that's your energy you are moving on from them could be a Capricorn again I'm seeing here the devil because you feel it's a very toxic energy okay let's clarify really quick really quick the world just see what is going on with the world for Aquarius for September what's going on with it? okay so this King of Pentacles so this is a uh, earth energy and again your energy Queen of Swords okay all right so could be dealing with their earth sign or I'm feeling here one this guy this earth energy is dealing either with you either with the water sign okay and that's why you feel betrayed because they are three people could be could be not only you know what resonates for you but you feel you are ending with this person with this and uh, earth energy because it's strongly earth you are feeling step back three of pentacle you are feeling step back I feel strongly Capricorn or a Virgo okay but let's see what's coming in the future so we have the tower we have the hangman we have three of cups we have eight of wands and we, ha we have the high priestess so now you are reflecting after this 
yending okay because we have here a lot of endings so at, at this point in your life you are like this hangman okay it's like nope I will just be by myself because now I'm in tune with me because something better it's coming to me that's why we have here either you will celebrate after you'll start communication probably with the fire sign or with the Libra or what I'm feeling here this is your card you are in tune with yourself because the high priestess is a is a Libra card okay but could be your energy too okay so at this in the future what I'm seeing here even to the end the endings I good I always tell people do not keep that is not the ending okay the tower in reverse it's not an ending something is business unfinished but as I read just card cards like this I see something ending very quickly very abruptly and very harshly but it's for a good cause and put you to reflect towards what happened at this and probably you reflect towards this three-party relationship because it was a crowd was three people involved okay even you felt is your soulmate one of them okay this person you've been involved it's that's how you felt is your soulmate is your twin flame okay but I don't think it is because some twin flames come in our life just to give us a lesson and to show us our right the path who we need to have and now you're in tune because you start communicating freely because that's what you want for your life okay and also I clarified the tower so the wheel of fortune so that shows me you are dealing with a karmic partner probably but the wheel is turning over and over and over so you start moving in your life probably this relationship you've been was involved a commitment could be you've been for a long time with this person you were dealing or, or been a divorce here because we have the justice here and now you want to take a leap of faith for new passion beginning but probably could be a fellow Aquarian you never know or you might know the person who comes towards you okay the hangman is it's clarified by ten of swords so again from the this energy from the present energy in the future when you reflect you reflect about this betrayal about this stepping back to you about this hurt you've been through oh okay and this three of cups is clarified by page of swords so you or the other person it's a little spying towards each other or either like you are dealing with a mature person but what I'm feeling here it's you or the other person you were dealing it's it's spying either you're spying on them either they're spying on you but could be you know through the friends you know hey did you talk with that person how they are doing you know okay and high priestess I clarified and it's four of cups so something somebody give you an offer and you basically refuse it or they refuse it and now you know okay from the Dorian Virtue Romance Angels we have in the past flirt extend your light-hearted energy to others so you had a lot of passion towards this person and you wanted to work towards the relationship you've been but didn't go nowhere also in the present is make the effort which I'm feeling here make the effort to get away from this toxicity that's what I'm saying here okay that's the advice card make the effort to move on because being too much it's too much heartache here okay too much heartache so please 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 
reflect on this as you see here it's too much it's too much on your table so that's how they say make the effort and for the future it says you really you deserve love you are lovable so now you know you are in tune you want to take a leap of faith because you want this new start a new refresh new fresh beginning and also at the bottom of the deck is release your ex okay release this person was a very toxic person for you okay very toxic they hold on on you why because they might have this person in their life and now you are very cold to each person even if you want to move on from all this so find strength in yourself release it because good things happen to you after this commitment even if you are burdened you will move away okay you'll move away from this all this and you see it's coming your son it's coming your wish fulfillment probably you'll have a new start with the Leo because the Sun is a Leo card and also from the angel answers is ask your questions and communicate clearly tell yourself that's what I'm feeling here you gotta tell to yourself what you really want from your life communicate to your inner self what you want from this relationship to have or what you want to happen to you be true to yourself and believe me or not will come to you because it's a yes it's a new open it's a new fresh start it is coming to you okay the universe is giving to you a new fresh start something very great is coming towards you very great and you know it you know it you're moving towards that okay that's what I'm seeing and you'll get away from this because you know it deep inside you already all right my lovely Aquarian this is your reading for September 2018 please like subscribe and comment all right if you love my readings comment below and tell me how I can improve all right have a good day namaste